And if you don't have cards, which have numbers on them, then it's okay. You can use pieces of paper and write the numbers and you can cut them out and put them like a tin roll. So he, today we have some cards over here and we're going to play the game trash with these cards. So first what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one card and I'll put it at my first place. So that's number one. Number two. Number three. And number four. And this is number five. And then I'll go on the bottom. Number one, number two, number three, number four, and number five. So now I got these cards. Let's get started playing. But before we start playing, I wanted to tell you, like, whoever gets all their cards open, they win. But whoever doesn't get all their cards win, don't win, then it's okay. So let's get started with the game. Let's see what I get. I got a choker so I can put it wherever I want. Where should we put it? Let's put it here. I think I got a seven. I'll open the seven. I got a six. I think I'm winning. Okay, I got a nine. J. I got a J, guys. Let's put it as a 10. Oh, we got a nine. They already have so I can. You can even change it. And now let's take another piece. You could play with as much as people, but if your cards are now, you're gonna have to move some of the people out. But you could play with two people or three, as much as people we would like to invite, but not too much to make all the cards get finished. So what do we got? We got an A. So if you get an A, you might not know where to put it, but you'll put it on the first slide. You got me? The first slide. I got a K. K or Q are actually making you good at trash. So I got a K. This is how the K picture looks. And let's go on to our another picture. So I have two. I'll just put in the trash bin and I'll get another one. Three. I got a Q. So let's put in the trash. And I got a four. I got a seven, which I already have. Oh, look what I got. Joker. Let's just put it as my five. And I got another eight. So I completed the game. And when you get all these cards open, that means you win the whole game. So if I if I didn't win, then um then then I would lose the game. So you saw I made an A which is first two, three, four, five, but which is a joker, six, seven joker, nine joker. So so in trash you actually keep them like five rows at the top and five rows at the bottom. And so I removed my joker to add a 10 so you could see how the 10 looks like. We put numbers to sequence to A to 10, like A to 10. So, so I wanted to tell you guys something. So did you know what? That joker is one wild card. So like if um, I, um, so I have one card open, but it kept losing and the cards were finished. I could look for the joker and I can add it on my last card or where a number I can't find and that I already have and I keep finding cards, a joker can help me out. So and if I find a joker, I could put it at my card and then I can look for another joker and I could put it at my card if I don't know where that is. So like I was saying, Joker is a wild card and it's actually pretty easy to, and it helps you to make you win. So like for example, um, I couldn't open one card, I kept opening, but there was only jokers left. So I took the joker and I added it as my five. So that's really easy about Joker is that you won't have to put it where it has to be. You could put it wherever you want. But where we usually keep the Joker is actually... But I 
just like putting it where I want it, but one joker, I kept it as the eight spot where it usually be, but my rest joker, or as my 10 and my five, but could I tell you something special? Did you know what? I am really good at trash. I can beat my mom and dad at trash. And mostly I like playing with my friends and my parents too. If you have cards like these, you could play along with your parents or friends. I hope you're enjoying this video. Please remember to give a like and subscribe and like to my channel for Kids Creation by Priyasha. Bye!